Hey everybody, Vicky here from Tales from the Trails, and we are looking today at Tiny Glade. It is like a, a little diorama game where you can build, well, build buildings, like little towns, little villages, all quaint and beautiful. But what I want to go through today is windows, and in particular, square windows, because they are more than just windows. It sounds silly, but it, it is true. So what we're going to do, we're going to grab a little like a little building and we're gonna work with that we're gonna build it up we're having a nice green one and it is square windows what we're looking at i'm gonna set the angle of the sun just temporarily so we can see what we're doing and as we're working as you can see these are vines growing up the side of the building as well we're just gonna put in a little pathway so we can access this building because a lot of things happen when there's like a, a path nearby. We're just gonna get rid of these bushes. Okay, window, the square window here. It can become a door. So essentially we're gonna put a few doors down. I say a few because if you put a door next to a door, it becomes a double door. And then when you put another door next to the double door, you get a triple door. Which is kind of cool, they, they thought it out really well. Let's get rid of these bushes and plants. Let's change this footpath a little bit, just get in there. Yeah, if you draw a footpath up to a building, you will get a door automatically. I prefer the square ones. The windows as windows. You put one down, you get one window. If you click on it, it'll change what it looks like as well. So if you put another window next to a single window, you'll get a double. And then a triple if you put one next to that as well. So we've got a, a triple, a double and a single. And if you click on it, it'll change what it looks like, the appearance of it. There is um, the washing line one, which the linen. If both windows have washing, then it'll make a line. And you can do that to span across buildings as well, which is kind of cool. So yeah, we're just going to finish decorating this building. Also, the game does put things on the floor as well, near windows. And windows can be corner windows. And you just literally put it on the corner of a building. Very, very simple to do. As long as the space. So, it looks kind of cool. It's like one of those um, weaving cottage, old English thing. And windows can also be put in the loft. As dormers. So you got the single, your double, and your triple as before, and also there are different varieties. So if you click on it, you'll get a different like type. Like one will have a window box, one will have a nothing, one will have a bit of washing on it. And it is really well made and very well thought out as well. So I hope you do find this video useful. Um, find it useful if you are playing the game because it does not tell you a lot about it. It kind of lets you explore and learn for yourself. So yeah, you can carry on watching. This is, I'm just building a little bit more. And I've already gone through what I wanted to go through. The square windows. I will be doing more videos on this particular game because it's cute. It's only small. And yeah, have fun with it. All the best. Hope you found my videos useful in some way, shape or form. If you don't subscribe already, please do so. And happy trails.